Audrey Gray, a senior editor at eGear, and we are here in New York City at Chelsea Piers on a gorgeous autumn day. It's just the kind of day you'd like to capture on a digital sensor. And here to do that with me is the new Samsung L74 Wide. This is Samsung's new metal small point and shoot, and as its name suggests, it has a wide angle lens, which means that you can turn around and if you're zoomed fully out, you can get an entire row of boats or a tall building in your frame without having to back up. Also very useful if you're like in a group situation, if you're at Thanksgiving table, you can get the turkey, the family, even the kids table all in one shot. Now Samsung is a Korean electronics company. They started out making all sorts of things other than cameras. They're fairly new to the digital imaging market. They make flat panels, washing machines, you name it. What that means is that designers in Korea tend to put really interesting, unusual features on their cameras. This one, for instance, has a world tour feature, which actually gives you maps and information about major cities around the world. For instance, it tells me that I could take one of these boats out for a luncheon cruise here in New York on the Hudson, which would be very fun. Another unusual feature for a camera is that the three-inch display on the L74 wide is actually a touch screen. Now, I found it slightly unresponsive to your finger but with this little stylus that is included with the camera, you can navigate pretty well, pretty fast. Unfortunately, I've been spoiled because, like so many of you, I've had a chance to play with an iPhone, which is incredibly responsive to the touch. Now, the iPhone, of course, has a 2 megapixel camera in it. This is 7.2 mega megapixels, approximately the same size, approximately the same size display screen. But like the iPhone, the price of the Samsung L74 wide has dropped significantly already. And you can get this camera right now for about 250 bucks.